Hey guys, welcome back to Holistic Home Setting with the Hearsts. I'm Megan, and I wanted to show you how I was going to be productive on a Monday morning, how we kind of run our routine, and it's all kind of gone to poo. So we had a dog throw up on our rug. Hadassah, come here, baby. I didn't get much sleep last night. My baby, I think, had gas or four months sleep regression. I don't know. You never know. And then, let's see, what else? Oh, and then one of my children decided to do something they weren't supposed to do. Ended up spilling the pot of water that sits on our stove everywhere. So, I am unfortunately having to clean up that mess. Plus, yesterday we decided to take a break and not do anything after church and um, just to kind of relax and stuff. And that just kind of piles up on Monday morning. So, I know that there is a time for everything and we need to take a rest day every now and then. Um, but I just feel like, I don't know, it was really discouraging to take a rest day yesterday and to know, see all the stuff that we have to do today. Anyways, I'm going to clean up this mess and then we're going to go out and feed the animals on the homestead and then hopefully we can get to homeschooling today. So, I'll take you guys along with us. So the kids went and did their chores already. Micah helped me. How many eggs chore. did we get? I think a dozen. A dozen. So how many eggs is that? Twelve. Yes. Okay. So, um, Hadassah stayed in here with me, the littlest one. Hadassah, are you going down with me to feed Daisy or are you staying inside? I want to go and visit Daisy. You want to go with me to feed Daisy? By the way, Daisy is looking a lot bigger. Oh, is she? Okay. Let's go feed Daisy, okay? So we've been having some work done here. We're adding on to our house. So I don't know if they're coming back today or not. Be Monday. We got this cool wagon. I'm gonna use. To pull the hay up the hill. As you can see, I showed you in my last video the what they've done, so I haven't have any updates. Maybe they'll come back today and have some updates for us. Looks like I need to give the animals some more water. There's Daisy. Waiting patiently. I need to scoop out her stall too. And we need to take a load of trash to the dump. So, you know, just a bunch of different things that need to be done. Morning, Daisy. Good morning. All right. Now. Where did your brother and sister go? Where's the... I see you. Uh, I forgot to take the bucket. Okay, go get the bucket. All right. Um, okay, so Daisy, we keep all of the feed in these barrels here. Daisy gets a little bit of... What is this? Kelp? This is kelp. And then she gets alfalfa. 
and this one, and a few sunflower seeds. So all of that helps keep her healthy while she's pregnant. And she has a salt block up there in the field for her to lick. So we're just going to get her fed. Okay, so we have been spreading out her hay or putting her hay in different locations every day so that we can grow some more grass in this area and get a lot more um, fertilization from her poop so that it's not all concentrated in one area. And then this past weekend, Brian and I and the kids kind of helped, but mostly Brian <laughs> sawed up a bunch of wood um, trees that had fallen on our fence down in the lower field and so he sawed all that up and split it for firewood so we'll be able to reconnect that fence back up and uh, allow her to go down there once spring hits and we are out of the rainy season the uh, it floods really easy down there so we don't want to put her down there right now so anyways that's just kind of an update on our field production I guess we also got to get the rest of that wood that we had milled out of the field into the barn to dry so lots of stuff lots of stuff also I was anxious about replenishing our small stock of provisions I have not gone very well a couple of friends who have proven to We just finished up school Mom, and Wait, I made something that's really cool. Watch this. Listen to the sound. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Wow, that's really cool. <laughs> I just, as soon as I spun it, I was like, why could watch? That's really cool. Finished up school. I tidied up the house just a little bit. I have um, on my to-do list today is I have to start going to butcher this name but tower chamois chamois flowers I'm not really sure how you say them they're very pretty <laughs> so but I have done all of my dates on my calendar of what seeds that I need to start and when they need to be started so technically I was supposed to start these like last Thursday but within like a week of when I'm supposed to start them is when I start them. So I also have to go down to my seed room and water all of my plants. I'm going to bring my sweet peas out in the sun so that they can um, kind of get used to being out here because I'm going to be putting them outside pretty soon. 
it's been super warm lately, so we're gonna try that. And uh, then we'll see what else we can get into. Show us your heart, teach us your ways. We will declare, we will proclaim. We are saved by grace alone, through faith alone, in Christ alone. Now, hope and now, forever. Okay, so I was digging through my seeds trying to find the right ones, and I found a few that was like, I feel like we should go ahead and start those too. So, I said I wasn't going to do broccoli or uh, cabbage or anything like that this year, but I've already got the seeds and I don't want them to go to waste. I did not buy them. Um, so we're gonna try to start those today. They like to be started early. Um, I have some mixed salad greens. I did not eat a lot of these last year. Um, so anyways, I'm gonna plant them in my landscape and see if they come up. And I think that it'll be a pretty little border for our walkway. <laughs> So we'll see how that goes. Um, I have some Dutch cabbage. Like Again, I wasn't going to plant these, but I have the seeds. I don't want them to go to waste, and so we might as well just try again. I've just not been successful with them. I also have some Sweet Williams and some poppy seeds that I did try to start downstairs. None of, oh, my poppies did come up, but for some reason they like started laying over. So I don't know what happened to them. Um, and then my Sweet Williams have not come up at all. Um, so what I'm going to do, it's a windy day, so it's probably not the best day to do this. But I'm just going to broadcast them in this little area that I know I've already got some wildflowers coming up. I have some honesty flowers that are already sprouting. Um, they have, I'm pretty sure that they're honesty flowers. Just as they're growing, I've seen them come up here for the last two years. And they drop their seed and they reseed themselves really easily, especially like down our pathway and stuff. So <laughs> my baby's just watching me. <laughs> okay. So anyways, um, I'm just going to broadcast these right there. And if they come up, great. If they don't, oh, well, they haven't already come up and in, like indoors trying to start them. So I might as well at least try like out in nature and if they make it awesome if they don't you know I didn't put any extra time into it I'm just gonna sprinkle them out there and then the last one that I was telling you guys about they're they're asters they're tower chamois camois I don't know how you say that um, so anyways I'm going to start these and just follow directions from Johnny's seeds I've got my little binder here that I keep my notes in. So I'm going to get started on that. I also have to make some soil blocks to plant those seeds in and the broccoli and the cabbage. So that's the only downfall about starting the cabbage and the broccoli is I've already like, I've, I've got to make enough soil blocks. So anyways, while I'm doing that, I'm going to listen to a podcast and yeah, just kind of chill. It's a beautiful day outside so let's do this oh i used to believe sin made you angry with me but then you came close and tore that old veil you said you were proud of me Forget it's all about love, the love of the Father, Spirit, and Son. No, we cannot forget it's all about love, but we've been forgiven imperfect love. So, wake my soul, arise and shine, His glory lives in you. The story. Open 
my eyes to see The king of the cross is now fully alive And my shame did a Calvary Oh, we cannot forget It's all about love The love of the Father Spirit and Son No, we cannot forget It's all about love But we've been forgiven Imperfect love Awake my soul Arise and shine His glory lives in you Oh, the story of my Jesus Christ Forever makes us new 